<laughs> oh, wasn't it so cool to have the Blue Angels do some practicing? It was awesome. The loop? I loved yes. it. You feel the roar. Yes. It's great. Exactly. We'll get uh, rehearsal tomorrow and then, of course, the big show starting at 1030, both Saturday and Sunday. Chris Habermill actually took this really neat photo of the Blue Angels practicing a little earlier today. Ooh. Isn't that a neat wow. shot? And again, we had uh, three days to watch them and some really nice weather to watch them. A little on the breezy side tomorrow, 76 degrees on Friday. Still a breeze on Saturday, but not as gusty. Low humidity the next three days. The temperatures come up a bit, but the humidity level stayed down on Sunday at 81. The reason why we're about to get some cooler and drier air is we have a front on our doorstep. Do you notice the humidity up just a little bit today? It was also a little bit warmer today, so we have just enough moisture that as this front crosses through the area, a couple little pop up sprinkles will be possible now through about 10 o'clock. Nothing that's going to amount to a whole lot. It's not dramatically cooler behind the front. There's some 60s out here towards the northwest of us, but it's dramatically drier in terms of dew point temperature. Anytime you get these dew points, 60s to 70s, it is humid, but notice the 50s and 40 dew points. That's the drier air that's headed this way a little bit later on tonight. Temperatures right now, upper 70s in most spots, a little bit milder with 80 degrees Valparaiso 80 at Joliet 82 right now at Midway. There's the frontal position in the next hour and notice around nine o'clock a little sprinkle possible here over Chicago southwestern suburbs around 10 o'clock a little sprinkle right in northwest Indiana and then we're dry overnight as the clouds disappear and a nice cool feeling tomorrow morning low 50s western and northwestern suburbs upper 50s low 60s in Chicago low 60s in northwest Indiana breezy winds coming in out of the north and northwest and temperatures back in the 70s for tomorrow so drier and cooler for tomorrow. Only issue for tomorrow, the winds will be gusty and since they're coming in more out of the north and northwest, it will build the waves and allow for another round of high swimming risk. Not for everyone, not for Cook County or Lake County here in Illinois, but all of northwestern Indiana beaches and also southwestern Michigan. Anytime we have had these beach hazards up this summer, we've had fatalities. So you got to take those warnings seriously and that's up tonight. Northwest Indiana through tomorrow and at least for the first half on Saturday. Those humidity levels are going to stay down behind this front this weekend and Monday. They build a bit as we head towards the middle part of next week. That's also going to coincide with our next opportunity for some scattered showers and storms. So we get rid of the humidity, get rid of the heat at least by a bit. The next few days, 81 degrees on Sunday. Low 80s continue Monday into Tuesday. Humidity begins to build middle part of next week with a few isolated storms on Wednesday. A few scattered thunderstorms in the forecast next Thursday. Gorgeous couple days yes. on deck. Thank you, Albert.